Hey YouTube, Beaten Off with Chili Head back once again with another hot sauce review for you and today we are continuing my month long look at super hot sauces. Uh, this is the third instalment for this month and today we are returning to the house of Puckerbutt Pepper Company run by Ed Curry all the way over in the US. We've looked at them before, we looked at their yellow fever hot sauce uh, last time which was about 3 out of 5 on their heat scale and the one today takes it up a notch because this is their extra mean green hot sauce. You can see at the bottom there we've got four out of five on the heat scale this time so got to assume that this one is going to be packing a bit of a punch. Um, so you've got your standard labelling on the bottle here, um, it doesn't really change much for the Pepper Company between their sources, it's usually just the colour or something like that that changes so you've got your standard labelling and we've also got our standard ingredients list because it just says vinegar, peppers and xanthan gum. I think Ed likes to keep his secret blend of peppers um, a closely guarded secret and uh, he never really reveals too much about it. However, on the other side of the bottle it does give us a bit more of an indication because it says it's a smooth but intense ghost pepper blend infused with the highest quality peppers. It's green and the kick is hillbilly mean. So there's definitely some uh, ghosts in here so obviously yeah they're going to be packing some heat um, but other than that we're really just going to be getting the vinegar and the flavour and heat of the peppers so not much more to say really. Um, let's just give it a try. You can see that it's obviously got this um, really nice green fresh looking colour and what with it being a vinegar based sauce it is of course very runny but still as you can see hopefully with the camera lots of flecks there of um, chilies <laughs> and not, not much else to be fair so doesn't need much of a shake and I'm pretty sure this one's going to pour quite well too so let's get it open and we've got a drip cap um, let me just see if I can get rid of that yep there we go All right let's give it a sniff <sighs> yeah that, that does smell mean <laughs> Really all I'm getting is, is, is the chilies, <laughs> you know, there's, there's not much else to get. But it does have that typically green chilli vibe to it, you know, it, it doesn't, it, it's got that kind of almost grassy kind of note to it which you get with these green chilies. And it does smell very nice, I'm getting the, the vinegar as well. But yeah, the, those chilies definitely have that, that, that fresh, not herbal but like I say, kind of grassy fresh kind of aroma which is really very nice but it also smells very hot. So just getting the old trusty spoon and uh, let's get some on the spoon. I have to be very careful not to spill because obviously this is going to pour very easily. Give it a bit more. Okay so without further ado another super hot sauce from Puckerbutt Pepper Company down the hatch. Wow, straight away you get that almost pure ghost flavour. It's definitely got that hoop, that super hot um, flavour to it. It's really, really, actually it's quite nice, um, the flavour. It's, uh, it's really just pure chilli, <laughs> obviously. Um, I wouldn't be able to guess on the, on the blend of peppers in there, but like it does say on the bottle, it's definitely got that that pep that ghost pepper kind of flavor and the that fresh um flavor too which is really great to, to to know because that's um you know really really not artificial it's it's obviously very natural and um pure pure chili which is great the heat kicks in pretty much straight away front of the tongue spreading out to the roof of the mouth and the and the lips um back of the throat's not too bad uh, it is there but it's not too bad i'm just going to replace the cap um, but yeah, I mean, pucker but sauces, to be honest, I can take them or leave them. They are what they say they are. They're just vinegar and peppers. And, you know, they're very, they're, they're for the hardcore chili heads, yes. Um, and if you like sauces which really concentrate on the pepper themselves and really let the peppers shine, then these are the sauces for you. 
if you prefer your sauces a bit more complex, a bit more varied in flavour, a bit more um, unexpected things going on, then you know you're not going to get that from Puckabut. These are um, at least the ones that I've tried so far to be fair. Um, very simple, just vinegar and peppers. So you know it is what it is. Um, so heat wise I would probably say roughly about um, probably about a seven out of ten. It's pretty high up there um, but not the hottest I've ever had. But a decent kick to be fair you know I mean it's it is all over the mouth now. Like I say, the, the back of the throat's not too bad, but it is really concentrating roof of the mouth, tip of the tongue and lips now. They're really going off. Um, but not too bad. Uh, so yeah, about seven out of 10 on the heat scale, flavor scale. Like I say, it, it is what it is. It's, it's vinegars and chilies. So I'd probably go for about a six out of 10. It's perfectly acceptable, um, but nothing amazing. And it's really, Obviously, like most sauces, not to be used, just drunk off the spoon. It's um, meant to be added to um, food. And if you added this to your food, it would definitely deliver an extra kick, uh, which is really great. Like I say, it does have that um, really natural chilli flavour. It's very sort of, um, not overly floral, but quite grassy, which you kind of got from the aroma. And as it sits in the mouth, it, it just develops and keeps sort of, in reinforcing itself without without sounding weird um you just keep getting that really really nice chili flavor um but of course that is all you get it's just the chilies and the vinegar um but it's a perfectly great sauce and uh, if you are a hardcore chili head which most of you guys who watch my channel are then i'm sure you'll like this so um check out extra mean green from Puckabut, and i will see you all once again very soon next week with another review. Catch you all later.